Now, I wasn't, uh, wasn't thinking about preaching. But I knew somebody needed to. And the member called me and asked me if I could preach. They needed a word. And they called this morning and they're in Waco, Texas. And I just said, what a, what a job they did. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. But, but, but I love preaching. And I love sharing the gospel. Amen. And sometimes I love hearing others. Amen. 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 I mean, I, I don't know if y'all do, but I like to hear it. Preachers who have a powerful message Amen. that can rightly divide the word of truth. Amen. It helps me. Amen. 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 I'm not going to hold you very long, but most of us already know the condition of our country. We know the condition of our city and states. Oh, yeah. We know what's running rapid throughout America and <clears throat> this entire world. Amen. And I thank God for you. Oh, yeah. Hey, man. You know, you could have stayed home and got it. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they told me this morning. Yeah. They said everybody's going to get it. Amen. And I said to myself, why would I stay at home when I know I need to be in the house of the Lord? Amen. 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 And when I was young, I didn't like going to church. No. Anybody else in here? Hey, come on, now, y'all. I don't really know, man. You ain't got to tell me. I've been there, done that. In your age, I know, man. <laughs> Mom and dad, somebody making you go with them, hey, man. I'd have cut out. <laughs> Zigzag. I'd have get away. But, hey, man, as I've grown older, I've realized I need God. Hey, man. Amen. A lot more than he needs me. Oh, yeah. So I'm appreciative to just to be able to be in the house of the Lord. Amen. Now there is a word on today. Amen. To uplift the bow down here. And this time <coughs> of this coronavirus. Amen. Would you turn with me to Mark 9, 19 through 27? Try to be brief today. <laughs> well, I'm all restaurants closed. Oh, the restaurants are closed. <laughs> uh, I don't want the report to go out even if they ain't here. <laughs> the preacher, man, he took so long to see this. I know y'all to do that. Amen. There you'll find these words recorded. He answered him and said, O oh, faithless generation, how long shall I be with you? How long shall I suffer you? Bring him unto me. And they brought him unto him. And when he saw him, straightway the spirit tear him. And he fell on the ground and wallowed foaming. And he asked his father, how long is it ago since this came upon him? And he said, of a child. And often times it had cast him into the fires and into the waters to destroy him. But if thou canst do anything, have compassion on us and help us. Jesus said unto him, If thou canst believe, all things are possible to him that believeth. Straightway the father of the child cried out, and said with tears, Lord, I believe. Help thou mine unbelief. When Jesus saw that the people came running together to, amen, he rebuked the foul spirit, saying unto him, Thou dumb and deaf spirit, I charge thee, come out of him, and enter no more into him. Thank God. And the spirit cried and rented him so came out of him and he was as one dead insomuch that many said he is dead but Jesus took him by the hand and lifted him up and he rose Man. I want to talk from this thought trapped between faith and reality Amen. Amen. 
Yes. Amen. Many of us understand that we are in a pandemic. Yeah, you, you can fix that. Amen. Well, the threat of an invisible foe, amen, threatens the lives of many of us. This coronavirus challenges our faith and trust in Almighty God. Yeah. We've been instructed by man to stay in our home, to minimize our chances to avoid getting the virus. Yes, sir. We are faced with being trapped between our faith and this reality in which we live. Church, there are two major forces in this world that shapes our perfect perception of things. Reality is based many times on what we see. And faith is based on what we can see. Uh, yeah. My brothers and sisters, it's so very easy to be swayed by reality yes. because it is obvious. It's right there before our eyes. Amen. We can take it through the sensory process. Yeah. It to us is real. Amen. Amen what we see that's going on. Amen. Amen. We statistically can keep up with the virus. Uh -huh. Amen. But we can't see it. Yeah. We can actually pinpoint the recovery period and those who recover. Uh -huh. We can even keep up with the death count right. of those that did not survive mm -hmm. this virus. Yeah. Yes, people must realize that the evidence is there. Yes, Amen. People must realize this also. On the other hand, faith is the substance of things hoped for Amen. and the evidence of things yes. not seen. Yes. Our faith comes by hearing yes. and hearing by the word of God. Yeah. It really means that, amen, we don't walk by sight. Yeah. But we walk by faith. Yeah. That is every word that proceeded out of the mouth of God. Yeah. See, God has called us to be more than conquerors. Yeah. Yeah. God has called us to be invincible, yeah. amen, in this warfare that we're fighting. Yes, sir. And I already know, amen, even though the coronavirus has invaded, amen, in our a dominion, in our space, amen, only God could have allowed him yes. to be here. Yes, sir. Amen. And what I love about my God is God allowed him to be here, amen, those of us who are anchored, those of us who are rooted and grounded yes. in the word of God know yeah, yeah. that the enemy is not, amen, been loose. On us. Yes, sir. He's here. Yeah, yeah. But amen. God has restraints. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Amen. See, we gotta realize who we are. Amen. Yeah. When you are on mission for God and you're doing God's will, yeah, yeah. God, amen, tells us that no weapon formed yes, against man shall prosper. Yes, yeah. He says, Amen, you don't even have to worry yeah. about a coronavirus. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. He said, if you believe in me, yes. Amen, all things are possible. Yes. Yes. Right. Right. Amen, amen. Prophets of old realize, yes. even during times that they were conquered. Uh -huh. yes. Amen. That all the people had to do was repent. Yes. All they had to do was become godly sorrow yes. of what they had done. Yes. See, I, I saw Jonah slide in the Nineveh. Yes. And I saw Jonah preach. Yes. Amen. And all of the Ninevites, yes. Yes, sir. an ungodly people, yes. were saved. Yes. Jonah testifies himself. I knew. That's why I didn't. Yes, yes. Want to know? Yeah. Uh -huh. I knew you were going to forgive them. Yes, yes sir. God will forgive. Yes, sir. God will bless. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. We no we, 
who labor must labor by faith. Yes, sir. Yes, people whose perception is shaped by reality are called wise and logical and witty. People whose perception is shaped by faith are called dreamers, some sometimes crazy. Yes. Yes. Uncult. Amen. Yes. Yes. Realists are usually not strong Christians, uh -huh. but are controlled by material and circumstance. Yes. Uh -huh. Amen. Uh -huh. It's just a reality. Amen. 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 People of faith believe God can do anything. Yes, sir. Faith. Yes, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 Yeah, we, we got a song that he's never yeah. failed yet. Yeah. Yeah. And, and I believe that I'm not alone with the hymnologists. Oh, man. But we realize that God has never failed us yet. Yeah. Yeah. Being in America and being black. Yeah. And God has never failed you yet. Yeah. You ought to have something to shout about every now and then. Yes, Amen. It, it's not an easy thing coming up in a country where racism is running rampant right now. Yeah. Yeah. Even the White House, yeah. Amen, don't like black folk. Yes, sir. Y'all know it. Yes, Amen. Yes, Amen. Yes, I ain't saw Amen. Too many black people that go through that. Oh, no. I saw one. <laughs> one. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Hey man, he spoke to a doctor. <laughs> I'm wondering now if he realizes that he is not really being accepted as he is. Right. He has to go along with the grand. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. And this particular message, hey amen, we, we need to see some things. Uh -huh. Amen. Hey amen. Hey People of faith. Believe God can do all things but fail. And it yes, is sir. in the text mm -hmm. that we see the two opposites, a world of faith uh -huh. mm -hmm. and reality collide. Yeah. Yeah. Now the reason I need to preach this sermon is because there are those of us in this room right now uh -huh. that may be at some time in their life at the position that this father is in. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. The man was trapped between faith and reality. Uh -huh. He was in a very uncomfortable place. Yeah. A narrow place between what he believed mm -hmm. and what he saw. Yeah. His faith said Jesus could, but reality said he hasn't. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. yeah. Church, what do you do when you're trapped between faith mm -hmm. and yeah. reality? Yeah. When faith says he's able. Oh yeah. yeah. And sight and sight says not yet. Uh -huh. But we who are believers of Jesus Christ yeah. uh -huh. must always contemplate the fact that we walk by faith yeah. and not by sight. Not by sight. Yeah. Yeah. The Lord has given us, amen, some instructions to make sure we don't get trapped That's right. between Faith, faith and reality. Yes, sir. Yeah. He gave us some outs yeah. to be able to get out of under the traps of life. Yes, sir. Yes. That's why I told you you got to be careful about watching television. Yeah. yeah. Television, amen, gives you a vision. Yeah. That's what it is. Yeah. Yeah. And you might say, well, I can look at it and it won't bother me. That's a lie. Yes, sir. <laughs> People are not paying for advertisement at the rate that they're paying it financially. Uh -huh. And it's not getting a result. Uh -huh. yeah. It is getting the desired result. That's why they pay so much per second. Yeah. Y'all don't understand that, but it's yeah. real. Yeah. Amen. Mm -hmm. they, 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 they put it directly into your mind. Yeah. Through your eye cords. Yeah. Amen. Uh, that are the wonders to your soul. Yeah. That's what they're doing, amen, and, and they know they're doing it. Amen. The, the coronavirus, letting you see the death count every day, globally. Amen. You know that 700 and some died on yesterday in Italy. The day before, 400 and something. The day before, 300 and something. You're getting a chance to see a death count. Y'all know how shocking that was to us doing Vietnam, don't you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And we saw the, yeah. the flagships, amen, 
on, on, the, on the airways, amen, helicoptering in and out the bodies that were in the black bags. You understand? They know it creates fear. Yes, sir. Amen. It creates a situation where you don't dwell on God. Yeah. Yes. yeah. Amen. You dwell on the object that's in front of you. Yes. Coronavirus. I never seen it. Y'all hear me? I never seen Corona. Not not the Corona beer. I seen it. But not the virus. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Jesus, Peter, James, and John on the Mount of Transfiguration. And y'all know what he was doing there. He transfigured before them. Peter got excited and wanted to build an altar unto those that he saw there. Amen. Relegating Jesus to mere humans. Mm. But Jesus was more than a human. Yes, sir. He was more than a prophet. Yeah. Jesus was God himself. Yes, sir. And while Jesus was gone, amen, there came a man to his nine disciples. Uh -huh. and this man was a man of faith, but he saw the disciples fail uh -huh. in helping his son. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. And then when he saw Jesus them coming back, the Bible said he ran to him. Mm. And my brothers and sisters, because he sees his son convulsing and had seen the disciples praying, but the boy got no better. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He says to Jesus, if, mm. amen, he says, if, yeah. you can do anything, yeah. Jesus turned the if on him. Yeah. He said, if you can believe, yeah. Yeah. All things are possible to him that believe, that believe it. <laughs> and see, that's what I want to tell all of us. All things are still possible yes. if you can only believe. believe. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah. See, I'm going to tell you something. I ain't going to say you ain't going to get sick. Right. But if you get sick, you got to believe that you got a God. Yes. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. Yes. That's able to hear you. Yes. Yes. You got to believe that you got a God. Amen. That will implement the right cure. Mm -hmm. That will implement the right situation oh, yes. Yes. for you to come out better yes. than you went in. Yes. You got to believe that. Yes. Amen. Yes. You got to believe in going in. Yes. Amen. Yes. Amen. You got to believe in that. The father says with tears in his eyes, Lord, I believe. Yes. But he reveals something. Uh -huh. He said, but help thou. My, my unbelief. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you know that sitting in the pew with you is a certain amount of unbelief? Mm -hmm. Do you know that? Uh -huh. Amen. You can be sitting right there. I, I just believe if we really believed and didn't doubt at all. Uh -huh. Amen. The church would be full. Mm -hmm. Amen. I believe that. If we believed and didn't doubt at all, we would have more goodness. We would have more power. Yes, yes sir. Yes. Oh, yeah. We, we would have, amen, mountain moving faith, power, and faith. Yes, sir. Amen. amen. See, I just believe that there's a certain amount of doubt in all of us. Yes. Uh -huh. Amen. If we really believe, we wouldn't have to preach to you about coming to church. Amen. You would already be yeah. at church. Yes, sir. We wouldn't have to rush in our sermons. Amen. To get through. Because if you believe, yeah. you would want to hear more. Oh, Amen. Yes, yes, sir. Amen. Amen. But we who profess to be the children of the living God. Oh, Amen. Don't really want to hear very much. Yeah. Amen. We get more excited leaving yeah. than we do coming. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We <laughs> want to go back out into the world. Yeah. Uh -huh. Now it's all right to want to go back out there if you got something to take out. Yeah. But if you ain't got nothing to take out there to transform the world, then you shouldn't be excited about going out there. Uh -huh. 
Because you know the coronavirus. Is <laughs> 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 out there. Amen. 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 Could be in here if one of y'all brought it. I told y'all to sit. You need to stay home. Amen. 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 Now, the thing that I love about God is this. Uh -huh. We have to make sure that we love God. Amen. amen. We have to be certain that God, amen, we understand what God has done. Yeah. Amen. See, God is doing stuff for us when we don't even know. Amen. 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 We don't even know. They say everybody in here right now is sick enough to die. Amen. Well, but it's because of the power of God yes. resonating in our lives yes. through God's Holy Spirit that God is healing and sustaining us. Yes. Yes. That's what I love about God. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. Reality shows us Amen. The severity of the situation. Uh -huh. Amen. Yeah. And, and does not want you to see past deliverance. Yeah. Could I tell you that as a child of God, you got to be able to see past yeah. deliverance. Oh, yes. yeah. but first of all, we got to recognize that reality has limitations. Y'all yeah. know that? It has limitations. Yeah. Amen. Amen. We used to say seeing is believing. <laughs> Amen. But with this means of diversion, y'all got to watch this. What we're facing in the coronavirus is a diversionary tactic. Yeah. See, all of us are fo focusing on an invisible virus that we can see the pandemic effect. Yeah. But ain't nobody watching the kitchen. <laughs> Are y'all better break up? Yes, sir. <laughs> something going on in the, in the kitchen. Yes, sir. Yeah, something's going on in the kitchen. Yes, sir. Everybody's focused on this invisible virus mm -hmm. that's creating illness and sickness and death. Mm -hmm. But nobody's watching the biggest liar I've ever seen in life. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah. We know who his daddy is. Amen. Don't nobody lie that much. <laughs> Unless they dead. The father of lies. The father of lies. Yeah. Yeah. See, you gotta make sure you don't get caught up in this thing. Amen. Where they pull your mind <coughs> off over there to look at something else. <coughs> and in reality, something else taking place. Amen. Uh -huh. They have the whole world now <laughs> focusing on. Coronavirus. Yes, sir. Our financial institutions, all of our jobs, and all of the things are being affected now. Yes, sir. like never before. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Amen. He said the banks are in better situations now than they were before y'all bailed them out. Yeah. Well, let me us we bailed them out. Amen. Uh, Amen. They they better now. But the problem that I have is, Amen. There is no money going in. Mm -hmm. And if money is just going out, uh -huh. you're going to have a problem. Right. Eventually, some's going to run out. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Y'all know how it is when you don't have enough money to buy the proper tires on your car mm -hmm. and you're riding on leaf hops. <laughs> Even if the tide don't blow out, it could rain. Yes, sir. On this asphalt. Like riding on ice. <laughs> Y'all hear me? You, you, you gotta, there's some dangers out here that are very prevalent. I tell, I, I, I told my daughter and my sons and they, they, they take this time off work and uh, it seems like a vacation. They, they want to go out and party and fraternize and enjoy themselves. I said, hey, y'all. I mean, I ain't scared because I'm in my 60s. I said, but this really, really ain't a time to be out there running around with your buddies. Amen. 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 I ought to get a little closer to God right now. Amen. Talk to God. Find out what God is telling you. Find out if He got an assignment for you. Yeah. Amen. Because you you could be trapped. 
yeah. between yeah. faith and reality. Amen. Yeah. And might not even know that it's a trap yeah. Yeah. because of diversionary tactics. Yeah. You might just think that it's just normal, but it ain't normal. No, no, this is not a norm. I'm telling you. No, no. Amen. Well, people who come to church don't come yeah. because they're afraid uh -huh. that they could come in here and get too close to one of y'all mm -hmm. and have a violence. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let me tell you. See, y'all said it about right. Y'all look too close. <laughs> Please don't tell her. I got, I got to make sure y'all understand. Tell her these ain't no joke. Oh. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You'll find yourself going back there. Amen. Amen. But it shows us. Uh, the severity and, and sometimes we can't see past deliverance. My brothers and sisters, reality will only show you what's right before your eyes. Yeah. And will even cause you to reject human effort to encourage. Amen. You can try. Amen. To cheer a person. Amen. That is persuaded by reality. And when you finish. They all said, but. You understand? You tell somebody that didn't come this morning, you said, came to church, we had a great time. Yeah. Yeah, but. <laughs> you could have a vibe. <laughs> yeah, you could too. <laughs> See, I, I always said that it has to be airborne. Right? It has to be uh, brought in through air. Yes. Amen? And, 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 and it ain't necessarily coming in through handshakes. Yeah. It's coming in through nostrils, yes. mouths. Amen. Amen. Eyes. They said, don't let your hand get close to your face. I said to myself, how you gonna watch your face if you ain't got that hand up there? <laughs> but, but but I'm listening to tell us this. And they, 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 they amen. Now this is the thing that got me, and y'all listen to this. Amen. Most of the nurses who are actually administering the care end up with coronavirus. coronavirus. Now you tell me, if they know what they're doing, yeah. how could they have caught it? Right. When they should know how to conduct themselves when they're dealing with someone who's already infected. Amen. But they ended up with it. Yeah. So, so I said, it's better for me to just go to church Praise God. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Ain't no sense of me sitting out here running from a virus I can't see. Yeah. I've been running to it. <laughs> Amen. Trying to get away from it. <laughs> yeah. We, we got to learn how, amen, to use our wit. To please God. Yeah, we got to please God. If we please God, I just believe he's never failed us yet. Amen. And that's what we sing about, right? Amen. If he's never failed us yet, then we might ought to be trying to make sure that we line up with God, we please God, we do His will, and if He never fails us yet, I don't believe that He will ever. Yes, yes. Amen. I told you, reality is something else. Amen. Amen. They'll say, but in reality, it denies the power of God. That's what we're dealing with right now. Amen. In reality, it denies the power of God. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. yeah, man. Oh, yes. Man, can you imagine that? You can let reality cause you to deny the power of God. Mm. Oh, yes. Yeah. yeah. See, I, I still remember when I was a rich. Mm. A rich undone. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. I was unfit to live and too mean to die. Yes, sir. I was a sinner, Amen. caught in my sins. Yeah. But God but looked God. beyond my faults. Glory yeah. God. And saw all the one of my needs. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I see, I thank God for that. Amen. Yes. Only a God could have yeah. delivered me. Yes, sir. Yes. And see, 
Thank God that he has delivered not only me, but he's delivered all of us. Thank you, Lord. Yes. That's what I, I believe in. See, when I realize how powerful my God is, yes. and that I have been bought with a price, yes, sir. and how Jesus hung, bled, and died for my sins and yours, yes. 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 and that, amen, uh, his blood, his yes. blood. Yes. amen, washed me yes. and made me White as snow. Yes, yes sir. I realize, amen, how, amen, to understand and to recognize wow. that reality has its limits. Yes, sir. Yes. But secondly, Jesus is not bound by our reality. Amen. Y'all know that? Thank you, Lord. He's not bound by our reality. Amen. God's ways are not our ways. Amen. Amen. The limits that limit us don't limit God. Right. See, if, he said that if any man be in Christ, yeah. he is a new creature. Yeah. All things are passed away, and behold, all things are become new. Yeah. Imagine this now. You're not the old man or woman that you used to be. No, no. Yeah. Amen. 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 And, and now, amen, yeah. you understand, you got something that the old man and the old woman didn't have. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Amen. You got, amen, cosmic help. Yes, sir. Amen. amen. You got, amen, a paraclete. Yeah. And that's the same. Uh -huh. you, you got, amen, a partner. Yeah. In this adventure of life. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. And he walks yeah. with you. He yeah. 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 talks with you. Yeah. He tells you yeah. that you are a child yeah. of his own. Yeah. Yeah. You got to understand that we're not alone anymore. Yeah. 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 Amen. Sometimes I know that he's invisible, but when yeah. coronavirus is invisible. Yeah. Yeah. I, I got to be able to deal with you about faith. See, you, the corona helped me today. Yeah. He made me to realize, even though he's invisible, yeah. yet, amen, he is doing some things in some people's lives. Yeah. And, and I think that my God yeah. is bigger yes, sir. than any corona. Yeah. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. I believe he is. Yes. Yes. Amen. yes. We got to remember, amen, that Jesus is not bound by our reality. Yeah, and Jesus revealed the total situation. And, and, and the Father admitted his weakness. Yeah. See, when Jesus turned the gift back on the man, yeah. the man then had to fess up. Yeah. He said, Lord, I believe. Yeah. He said, but yeah. help thou mind unbelief. See, you got to look at yourself now. Yeah. See, the man fessed up because there was a need greater than a man, his reality. Yeah. His reality limited him, but he wanted something that went beyond his reality. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And the only way that he could get that, a man, he had to let God know, I got some unbelief. Yeah. In my closet, yeah. 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 Amen. In my baggage, I got some unbelief. Yes, sir. And I just believe every one of us in here got some baggage. Amen. We got some baggage of unbelief, amen, because we're not stepping out on faith. Because when you step out on faith, you step out on thin air. Yes, sir. Yes. Oh, God. Oh, my. Yeah. Oh, y'all don't want to hear that. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Amen. You know, okay, you know you're supposed to tie. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. But you don't tie. Amen. Uh -huh. Amen. That means you got doubt. Yes, sir. Yeah. Hello? Yeah. I'm going to say it a lot of you hear it. Amen. When you know you're supposed to be at Sunday school and you don't go. Yeah. Uh -huh. Amen. That means yeah. that you got doubt. Yes, sir. Come on. Amen. Uh -huh. yes, sir. When you go to be at Bible study. Amen. And you don't show up, you got doubt. Yeah. Uh -huh. Come on. When you don't love. Your enemies. Yeah. Bless them that curse you. Yeah. Pray for them that despitefully use you and say all manner of evil against you. You got that. Yeah. Yes, sir. Do you know what you got? Amen. Because, yeah. amen, the Lord told you, amen, to keep my commandments. Yes, sir. Yeah. 
And if we keep his commandments, yeah. then we already know that he's going to be right there yeah. for us. Yes, sir. Yeah. Amen? Amen. Oh, yeah. But we got a problem with that, and most of us will say it. Reverend, I ain't got there yet. Oh, Lord. Yeah. Yeah. Down about I, I can't, I can't, I can't <laughs> love my enemy. Why can't you? Amen. Amen. God said we did. When you were an enemy to God, He loved you. That's right. Didn't He? Yes, sir. Yes. You know you were an enemy to God. You didn't do what God said. Amen. You did what you wanted to do. Yes, sir. Amen. You know that song we used to sing? Amen. To encourage women to be independent. No, it is your thing. No, oh, no. Do what you want to do. Now, we didn't mind y'all saying it because we liked it that way. Hey, you're right. <laughs> Amen. But it really is not our thing. Amen. We belong to God. Yes, sir. Amen. 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 We've been bought with a price. Yes, sir. Amen. He owns us by paying for it, but he also owns us for creation. That's Amen. right. Yeah. He Amen. created us. Yes, he did. Then he owns us because of redemption. Amen. Amen. He redeemed us. Glory. Oh, yeah. So we, we, got a, we got a problem when we don't want to line up with God when it's the simplest thing to do. Amen. I think the world needs to see a church. Yeah. Amen. That knows how to show their love for God. Yeah. Amen. They do. Amen. They do. And if the world, the Bible said in John 17, he said, Father, he prays for the church and said, Father, make them one as ye and I are one. Amen. Then he goes and says something like this. He said that the world may, may believe yeah. that thou hast sent, sent me into the world. Yeah. And I, I came up with the realization that until we come together as one, yeah. 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 then the world won't see nothing different. Amen. The world ain't going to see nothing different until we come together yeah. as one. Somebody yeah. out there, yeah. Reverend yeah. Hoffman, trying to bring us together to do something. He won't populate. I don't know what populate. No, no. Yeah. All of the prophets, oh, great to be glorified. on the most part, were martyrs. Yeah. Y'all don't understand that. Yes, sir. Some of y'all are the glory seekers. You, you'll get it. <laughs> Amen. But they had the sense enough to know that they needed to be about their father's business. Amen. 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 Some of them were so bold that they didn't want to be crucified like Christ. Amen. No, no. Said, I'm not worried. They turned me upside down. Upside down. Yeah. Amen. Oh, yes. Yes, I'm holding y'all a little too long. <laughs> but the father cried out and said, Lord, I believe. Help thou mine unbelief. Yeah. And Jesus said to the evil spirit, come out of him and enter no more into him. And the dumb and deaf spirit came out of him. Amen. Amen. Thank God somebody listens to Christ. Amen. And the boy was as a dead person. Jesus not only used the word to cry out and call the demon out, but then he used his touch. Amen. And Amen. touched the boy. Yeah. Uh -huh. And the boy rose. Mm -hmm. Well, I got to get ready to leave you. Now, but when trapped between faith and reality, uh -huh. mm -hmm. we must do as Amen. Proverbs 3 and 5 says. Yeah. Trust in the Lord with all thine heart. Yes, sir. And lean not unto thine own understanding. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. And in all of thy ways acknowledge him, and he, and he shall direct thy path. Yes, yes. Amen. We need to remember that reality has limitations. Yes, sir. Uh -huh. We need to remember that Jesus is not bound by our reality. Yeah. And then we have to do what the Father done. We have to accept God's word and work. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes, the father held on to his faith. Yeah. In the midst of all that he saw, the distraction of, of the people around, the distraction of the demonic possessed child, mm -hmm. the distraction of the disciples praying and were not able to heal his son. Uh -huh. And he held on to enough faith 
And church, we need to be praying Pray. unto the Lord more and more yeah. Yeah. as we see the evil days drawing nigh. Yeah. Oh yes, I want to leave you now. Uh -huh. But let me tell you a little story yeah. mm -hmm. about a man who prayed. Yeah. Mm. There was a story that told a man of an elderly lady yeah. that was told who received a sad telegram well, mm. that her son was dying and it read, if you want to see your son alive, yeah. please rush by his bedside. Well, the doctors have given up and he has just a short while to live. Yeah. Yeah. With tears in her eyes and no money to go where he was. Yeah. She took her pail and went out to milk the cows. Mm -hmm. While milking her cows, she kept praying, Lord, let me see my son one more time. Yeah. In this life and when she came in from milking the cow, she went in to a dresser. Mm, threw some of her frail amen clothes into an old suitcase yeah. and headed toward the train station. Yes, sir. Come on. She went in and sat down with, her, with all the other passengers. Uh, yeah. And soon the mighty mountain train, uh, amen, came to a stop mm, uh, in front of the rail station. Mm, uh, all the passengers clammed on, uh, including her. She sat motionless and sorrowful uh, in her seat. Uh, soon the amen, the conductor on the train shouted, All aboard. Yeah. The big mountain train uh, started climbing the tracks, uh, moved slowly down the tracks, and then increased its speed. Mm -hmm. Finally, the conductor, a man, came into her coach uh, and began to ask for tickets. Mm -hmm. When he got to her, she cheerfully passed up him for her telegram. Mm -hmm. Thank God, all right. He said to her, I am uh, a sorry man, uh, but you must have a ticket. Uh, Tears 
of sadness. Those are not tears of disappointment, but they're tears in conjunction that God still here and answers prayer. I just believe if you're trapped between faith and reality, we have a God that's an able God. I stop by to tell you on my way to the Zion that our God is an able God. I tell you how able He is. When we were too mean to live, unfit to die, hell was our destination. He dispatched His Son that was born of a virgin down in Bethlehem of Judah. Ain't God alright? Got to leave you now. But I stop by to tell you, our God is an able God. Our God is a powerful God. Our God is a transforming God. Yes, they took your law. And my God, from judgment hall to judgment hall, I tell you, they found him guilty of no crime but loving you and I. They took him on a hill called Golgotha. They there nailed him to an old rugged cross. Ain't God good? Out from the sixth to the ninth hour, he dropped his head in the locks of his shoulders. Gave up the ghost, thank God, good. Laid him in a barber tomb. Stay there all night, Friday night, all night, Saturday night. But I heard somebody say, on Sunday morning, he rose with all power. Good evening, reality does not hinder God from doing what he needs to do. If you're trapped today, I got good news. We have a God that can release all of your bounds.